TCE 23-2 has the overall goal of doing explosive hazard detect and defeat from deep water all the way through beach zones to enable naval maneuver. This is mine detection, this is obstacle detection, and this is route determination in an automated fashion across multiple sensors, multiple modalities, and multiple domains. Here being tested at TCE include things like ground penetrating radar, blue-green lasers, uh, EOIR cameras, the software behind all of those to do the data processing, their AIML enabled algorithms to lessen the burden on the warfighters to make determinations on the hazards and how to remediate them. The main role of ONR is number one, the sponsorship, but most importantly, they are providing the new technologies for the next set of capabilities that are coming to the Marine Corps. The Marines are participating to give warfighter feedback and test within field conditions to rapidly increase the maturity of those programs. The technology concept experiments are an opportunity to take hardware, software concepts, put them in the hands of Marines uh, in a real environment. And uh, we're looking at objects that are buried in the sand, that are submerged uh, in shallow water in the surf zone uh, and in deeper water. And we're exploring all the ways that uh, the Marines will use uh, that hardware, software, and concepts uh, to execute their missions. The Marines have been known uh, since their inception for their ability to come ashore uh, in foreign lands uh, and establish a beachhead and uh, move inland. Our goal here is to give them the best possible tools so that they can do that uh, quickly and safely and effectively. It's very important to me to, to see the technology and to give feedback because we're the ones that are going to be using it. And to get us out here to, to see how it works uh, with our tactics and our operations, it allows us to uh, weed through and see what, uh, what exactly we, lo we like and what we don't like. It's very valuable to give feedback so these uh, developers and these guys that run these companies get a sense of how we would use it and what we think would be useful and not so useful. Directly talking to some of the Marines, I think they were, um, we're talking to a different generation and they're accustomed to seeing a lot of technology development rapidly changing. So uh, one of the unique things about TC is that we are incorporating some of the early technology development. Uh, in addition to some of the program of record a system that are already fielded. So this allow uh, sometimes comparison, but also compatibility um, and you know, operability is being um, tested and also looked at. But most importantly, it's not really a performance metric, but more of an opportunity for us to improve the system and get a direct feedback from many users. One thing I really like about the technology is just the in fact, it takes the whole, it doesn't completely take the whole human element out of it, but it definitely makes our job a lot easier. It saves us a lot of time. We don't have to waste time scanning through areas that don't even have anything by hand when we can fly over any piece of this technology just to find the leading edge before we have to actually put boots on the ground to go in and further inspect it. So right now we're pretty much limited to mine detectors and probing sticks for searching for explosive hazards. So this will greatly increase our capability to do that. We can do that from further away, potentially flying drones from ships or from disparate locations. It can get that initial scan before Marines do that final push. It's allowing machines and technology to take that initial push into a potential dangerous area and removing the Marine from those situations. The collaboration here is, is tremendous. Uh, again, it brings uh, program officers who uh, typically sit uh, in an office building not far from the Pentagon uh, puts them uh, in touch with the Marines who are the pointy end of the spear, uh, who are working with gear, they're coming ashore uh, in vehicles, uh, they're surveilling the beach, um, and they're preparing uh, to do a real world mission. 